So time to go? Am I am I on? Am yeah. I live? Yes! Okay, okay, let's read this one. Dino by Diego Vesberg. Not sure that's right. One day a gigantic egg appeared in our backyard. Crack! We thought it might be a giant canary. Or one of those big lizards that show up in the summer. Or maybe a huge tortoise. But it wasn't any of those things. It was a dinosaur. He was so cute and friendly that we decided to keep him. We named him Dino. And from that day on, he was our pet. Dino wasn't very big at first. Rawr! But he grew and grew and grew until soon he was enormous. Having an enormous dinosaur in the house can be a bit tricky. Smash! Boom! So we played outside as much as possible. Dino's favorite game is fetch. Uh-oh, whoopsie. Though he doesn't always bring the, ba the ball back. Making new friends at the park is also a challenge. Dino's roaring for joy can sometimes be misunderstood. Roar! Ah! You me. I'm good. <laughs> All the excitement of being outdoors makes Dino hungry. And not just for food. Uh-oh. Gurgle. So, we have to... Keep a close eye on him if his tummy starts to rumble. Dino does make an excellent guard dog, though, because he isn't scared of anything. Beware. Well, almost anything. Sometimes it's hard to get him to put away his toys, and at the end of the day, sorry, sometimes it's hard to get him to put away his toys at the end of the day. Hmm, looks familiar. He won't his tablet. Oh no, that looks familiar too. And bath time makes him sleepy. So when it's time for bed. So then it's time for bed. We thought it was tricky having one dinosaur in the house, but then we found three more eggs in our backyard. Crack, crack, crack. Oh no. Crash, bang, roar. So we got a bigger house. A triceratops, two, a brachiosaurus, a one, and a long. The end. And then a That was cute.